burned down twice, but the historic Cedar Bridge in Madison County is back again. KCCI's Max Deeknight traveled to Winterset tonight to show us how the bridge has now been made much more fire resistant. Well, the good news is Cedar Bridge is back. And what a transformation it has been. Just two years ago, a second devastating fire ravaged Madison County's Cedar Bridge. It was a mess. We have six remaining covered bridges. And so when we lost Cedar Bridge, it was like this big hole in our community. The community rallied, though, raising more than $700,000 for a rebuild. But before that, people wanted to know what's going to be different this time around. We do not want to do this again. And so, yes, there are some things about Cedar Bridge that are different this time. The new bridge has a steel base, meaning if there is another fire, they won't have to rebuild the whole thing. They've also added cameras and installed fire suppression canisters throughout the roof. But another big question remained. The number one question people had after the fire was whether they'd still be able to drive through the new bridge. That became a focal point of the rebuild. As you can see, the county stayed true to the bridge's original design. Of all of Madison County's covered bridges, the Cedar Bridge is the only one you can drive through. Riley says none of this would have been possible without hundreds of thousands of dollars in individual donations. We're so grateful for the generosity of all those donors from across Iowa and around the world who helped us make this happen. Certainly we want that, that treasure back. Covering Madison County, Max Deeknight, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader.